What's up, people? Joe Winko here, your favorite Hawaiian guy. Here's my next playthrough for The Sims 1 Complete Collection. And uh, sorry it's been a really long time since my last episode of this. I've been kind of sidetracked with a bunch of other stuff I've been doing for YouTube. But I am back with the Winko family. There's me right there on the computer, if you can't see me. Just right there. And uh, my uncle, Romario, is at work right now. He got a new job. And let me show you the house we live in. Okay. So I, I kind of revamped it since the first time. Here's what it looked like at... Okay, this is what it looks like right now. I just changed it up. Here's what it looked like at first. And here's what it looks like right now. I used a darker shade of bricks to paint it with. Because I'm trying to give the house that gothic style look. Because that's really how my Uncle Romario's house looked in real life. It was a it was a gothic style mansion with a bunch of palm trees around it. So I have the palm trees right. I just haven't got the mansion part down yet. But I'm getting there. And I might have to add more palm trees. Because there were... At my real uncle's house, there were much more palm trees than this. <laughs> That's all I saw out there. I love palm trees. They're beautiful. So, in this episode... Oh, let me show you the inside, too. There's a bathroom, but I'm thinking about adding a second one. I extended the kitchen and eating area, added a, cha a table where they can eat at, and added some chairs. I added four chairs, just in case they have guests. And here's the bedroom. Me and Romario still share a bed, and here, if you notice, is a pet bed right here. Because we will be getting a pet in this episode. But there's another thing we're going to be getting. We're going to be getting Joe Winko, myself, a magic wand, so he can do magic spells. And I'm going to show you how I'm going to get that. So right now, Joe is at home on the computer playing uh, playing some game, some computer game. I'm ma making his fun need go up a little bit because it was kind of low when he got home. But I think it's high enough now. So jump in the hole in the ground and send him to Magic Town to get his magic wand. It costs uh, 45 simoleons to get a magic wand. And, uh, yeah, you don't have to pay it with magic coins. I haven't figured out how the children get the magic ingredients yet, so if anyone knows how the children can get mag magic ingredients, can you please type that into the comments so I can find out? Because I want Joe and Romario to start doing some spells together. Romario already has his magic wand. So, let's journey to... Uh, 94 Camelly Forest, Vernon's Vault. Okay. And here we are. So, how you get the kids to get magic wands, or any other sim who doesn't have one, you find the mystery man on this lot, he's right there. Oh, it's $50, actually. 50 simoleons. And then you buy one from him. You can also sell it back to him if you want to turn it in. Like, if you don't want them to have the magic wand anymore. And there! Joe Winko finally has his magic wand. I'm not sure how he can get ingredients, though. I think he might have to be sent on, like, magic quests. Let me look into that, actually. Oh, they can't interact with the merchants at all. The children can't. That's weird. So, I'm just gonna send him home. <laughs> I love the magic town. It's so creepy and everything. Well, it's not creepy. It reminds me of this movie I saw on Disney Channel called Halloween Town. I think that's what it was. It does have a Halloween feel to it. And the trees and everything. I wish they had something like that in The Sims 2. It'd be awesome. 
And Joe is finally home with his magic wand. So I'm going to have him go back on the computer. Actually, going to have him use the bathroom. Then have him go on the computer. Romario will be coming home in a couple seconds from work. Okay, Romario's home from work. And now, time to get our pet. Services. No, call cab. Explore Old Town. You can go to Old Town for free. Eventually, I'm going to send them on a vacation. But, uh... Not yet. Not till they get more money and have enough stuff for their house. I just don't want to blow money like that, sending them on to Vacation Island. Because you need a lot of money to go to Vacation Island. Oh no, the computer's broke? Yeah, better have him call a repairman too. Damn it. Hm. Oh well. I could have him fix it himself, but I don't feel like it. Yeah, I'll have the repair man stop by when we get back. So there's the shuttle that takes us to Matt to uh, Old Town. We're going to be getting a dog. I don't want to get a cat, because when you get cats, then mice start appearing in the house, and you have to have the cat kill the mice, and it's kind of annoying. There is a lot you can do in this game. Okay, adoption centers. Here's one. I love the whole Louisiana, Louisiana theme to this game. <laughs> okay, so we're finally in uh, an old town, and let's adopt a dog. <laughs> Not sure what I'm gonna name him yet. What should I name him? Something animal-like. Not something you name a human, but something you name a dog. Well, it's Scruffy, or Spots, or Boots, or something like that. Wait, why didn't he adopt the dog? What the hell? Oh, he's going. All right, Joe's hungry, so I'm going to have Joe get a pastry. Okay. Would you like your new pet to be a male or a female? Let's make him a male. Select your pet. No, 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 no. These are all dogs, aren't they? I was just double checking, because that one, I thought that was a cat at first, because it looked like one. Yeah, but that's definitely a dog. Um. Aw, this one's actually the cutest. Are you sure you want to adopt this pet? Yes. <laughs> awesome. Okay, what should I name him? Thinking Scruffy, or should I name him Ruffy? No, don't name him Ruffy. Let's name him Scruffy. Scruffy. <laughs> That's a cute name for a dog. <laughs> Look at him. We might get another dog later, once we have more money. 
Okay, now let's send, uh, let's send them home now since they already got what they need. Call a cab, go home. <laughs> oh, look at him. All right, let me snapshot this moment. Oh, hold on, that stupid guy's in the way. Is he following us, or is he just running around? Oh, let me have Joe play with him. Call over. He's so cute! Look at them! I mean him! <laughs> the dogs in The Sims 1 were the cutest. Play with, pet. You can play tag with your dog. Aw. Forgot about that. <laughs> Aw. Look at that. <laughs> I wish I had a dog in real life. Okay, let me snapshot this. Okay. And let me date it too. What's the date again? February 24th. February 24th, 2016. Joe Winko and Romario adopted a new pet a new dog named Scruffy. <laughs> Aww. We finally have a dog now. <laughs> He's so cute. And there's actually, um, I think I mentioned this already, but there's actually a way you can turn the dogs into real people in this game if you have making magic. We need to figure out the spells though. I could just read about the spells online, but I don't wanna don't wanna cheat like that. So we sent them home. We're gonna feed Scruffy, make sure he has enough food. Well he's not really hungry right now. So let's have Romario serve some dinner. Joe, his fun needs. I hate how their needs go down really fast when... Oh. Yeah, let him call the repairman first. Repairman, serve dinner. And Joe should... Joe should play with the dog instead. Play with, pet. Yeah, it helps their social need go up, too. And now Joe can play tag with them, also. <laughs> How do you play tag with a dog? <laughs> wow. Well, they're doing it right there. <laughs> Aw. That's so cute! Okay. Mario has dinner ready. That dog is starting to get hungry. <laughs> so he needs to fill, fill the dog bowl too. Yeah, we're going to need to get a new bed. That one isn't really comfortable enough. Okay, Joe's fun need is up high enough. Oh, wow. It went up faster than playing on the computer. <laughs> Aw. What's Scruffy up to? 
He's so cute. Can you teach them tricks? I think you can teach them tricks, actually. Gotta look into that. I'm gonna make you pay. What do you mean you don't have enough to pay me? I'm going to I'm going to take something you own as payment, you dad beat. What the hell? Oh, I hate that guy. He took the computer. <laughs> Whatever. We didn't have enough money to pay the repairman, so he took our computer. Never mind, we'll save up and get a new one. I was planning on getting rid of that one anyway. It's the last time we called the repairman. <laughs> uh, Joe passed out. Yeah, I better send him to bed. <laughs> Ah, there's he's asleep now. So cute. Scruffy. School bus will come in an hour. Carpool for Mario will come in an hour. Make sure to buy a pet bath to wash your dog when the hygiene is low. Oh yeah, I forgot about buying that. How much are pet baths? Um Oh, they're 349. Eh, we'll have enough once your Mario gets gets paid today. They get paid every day in The Sims 1. Wish that was true in real life. <laughs> that dog's funny. Now they have to go to work and school. And poor Scruffy will be here by himself. Oh well. He's so cute. Good thing he knows. This, good thing he knows not to pee inside at all. Oh, the maid was here. Forgot about her. Huh. We canceled the maid service. We don't need her. Okay, looks like Joe's home from school. And he's hungry, too. That's not good. Luckily, Romario will be home in a couple of hours to fix Joe something to eat. Until then, Joe needs to take a shower and play tag with the dog. 
Oh, he needs to answer the phone. Your psychic advisor's head has just exploded. Be forewarned. What the hell? That's a prank call. <laughs> yep, now time for Joe to play tag with his dog again. Still haven't figured out how he can get the magic spells yet. That's what's going to happen in my next episode. Actually, I have an idea. An interesting way to close this episode off. Let's have Romario cast magic spell. Okay, Romario's home. Goth, Bella, invite over. Oh, wait a second. He doesn't have any. Oh, he does have ingredients. Okay, Bella's coming over. So I'm going to have Romario get dinner ready. Add toad sweat, add toad stools, add butter. And who the hell is calling us right now? Let me answer it. Probably another prank call. A rich uncle has remembered you and his will. You get $600. Oh. Um... How ironic. Jeesh. Well, that's good, I guess. How much is a new computer? Let me see, since we need to get a new one now. Eh, I want to get a better one. Spawn 7. Spawn 9. Oh, 6,000. 2,800. I'll save up for that one. Hmm. Joe's playing tag with the dog again. <laughs> They're so cute. Where's Bella Goth? Oh, there she is. Oh, she brought candy, too. Too bad we're going to be casting a spell on her. Well, first, greet Bella Goth. Not going to greet her daughter at all. Don't feel like talking to her. Then grab a plate. Entertain, handstand, grab a plate. Congratulations, you made a new family friend. Oh, okay, awesome. Alright, did he have the ingredients yet? Charge wand? <laughs> What's wrong with Scruffy? Okay, Romario has his first magic spell now. <laughs> awesome.
You discovered a new spell. Check your family spell book for details. Ooh, awesome. So, now, cast totification. Our first pigeon, Bella Goth. I don't think she has a magic wand at all, so I don't have to worry about her. Oh, he casted it on her? Holy crap, didn't know he can do it from upstairs. Wow. <laughs> now Bella Goth is a frog hopping all over our house. That's not good. We need to figure out how to get more magic ingredients. Oh, now she turned back into human? I thought you had to have the... Didn't know it was temporary. I thought someone had to kiss them to, for them to turn back into human. Okay, hug, friendly, say goodbye. So, we might as well send Bella Goth home. And Romario needs some food too. Oh, she's being a bitch right now. Well, I don't blame her. She... <laughs> we just turned her into a fro frog, so of course she would be. So, um, that's basically it for this episode. So I'm just going to save my game and end this part of the playthrough here. And as I said in the last episode, I'm not going to record every single thing that I do with this family. But, like, if anything interesting happens or if I decide to do something interesting, I will let you guys know. I am going to keep adding on to the house and keep building on it because I want it to eventually become a huge gothic style mansion because that's how my real uncle's house was. It looked kind of like this, but I need to change the windows and I need to add, add more because this is how much of the lot I have. I could add a lot more and I can add more palm trees too eventually. I love the palm trees. I think they're beautiful and more of a garden too. I wouldn't even have to make them take care of it, because I could have a uh, hire a gardener or two. But that is basically it for this part, so don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and to my main channel too, Winko567. Don't forget to like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr. And that's it, so peace out, people.